Hey there, everyone. Welcome on back to the Cars Garage. Today, we are going to be talking about a rumor that has just came out not very long ago from Mickey Views. And it says that the Radiator Springs Racers famous ride over there in Cars Land in Disney California Adventure Park may possibly be coming to Walt Disney World's Magic Kingdom. This is pretty cool. I've never been to Disney California Adventure, never been to California at all. But I have been to Walt Disney World twice, and it's been a long time since I've been. But I just think that would be so cool if they did have something Cars related at the park. Because right now, they really don't have a whole lot, except for that little car show they have at Disney's Hollywood Studios. But it is what it is. Lady McQueen's Racing Academy or whatever it is. Anyways, I'll show you guys the article here, and I'll just read through it. I've got a few pictures, but it's really just pictures of Cars Land. So here it is. Let me screen record now. Just gotta grab the whole screen for you guys. All right, here we go. So it says, rumor, Radiator Springs Racers coming to Walt Disney World's Magic Kingdom. This is by Brayden from Mickey Views. I always watch his YouTube channel for updates because I don't know why. I just like to see updates at the Disney parks. <laughs> and well, he does Florida, but I watch uh, Fresh Baked for the California Park uh, updates just for fun. I don't know why. But anyways, it says here, according to exclusive reports available to Mickey Views, sources allege that the Magic Kingdom's long-teased largest expansion ever may include an already famous Disney attraction. So yeah, they've been just kind of talking about expanding the Magic Kingdom for a long time because I don't know if you guys know, but in Florida, the Universal Studios Orlando there, they are making, they're almost done actually next year. I think it'll be done next summer, 2025. But they are making this huge new land called Epic Universe. Well, it's many different lands. The whole new park was what it is. Uh, and well, Disney needs to combat that somehow. So that's why they want to expand their most popular park, the Magic Kingdom. It makes sense. And obviously it'd be cheaper to just you know, just rebuild an attraction that they already know how to make because they already made it before in the States. So I think that's a good idea, to be honest. Here's a picture of Radiator Springs Racers at Cars Land in California. And then it says, rumor says, when Disney began considering re-theming Frontierland at Walt Disney World into the Bayou, Imagineers realized that desert-themed Big Thunder Mountain was left without a land. And this is just an image that Braden made himself, I think, or his uh, Mickey Views made. But it just shows this is all just rumor. This is like from where Frontierland is right here, where the mouse scroller thing is. You can see that's where Big Thunder Mountain Railroad is right now. And then obviously, if you don't know, Splash Mountain, which was I think it was, you know, it's formerly in Frontierland. They're kind of making that whole part of Frontierland into like the bayou pretty much because they're retheming Splash Mountain right now as we speak into Tiana's Bayou Adventure. So a Princess and the Frog themed ride, which I was very upset about when I first heard that because I always love Splash Mountain. But um, it's shaping out to be pretty cool. The animatronics look promising. So I think it looks pretty nice. But it's not open yet. It will be very soon, though. But anyways, yeah, it seems like the bayou and you know, New Orleans Square, it's just kind of like taking up a lot of area there. So I think Big Thunder Mountain, it doesn't fit in in the bayou, obviously, and they don't want to retheme that, you know, it's, they want to keep that because it wouldn't be, I don't think it would be a good decision to retheme that ride too, because people love that ride and it's not based on any IP. So that's another reason why people love it. I think it's a great idea though. They kind of want to expand the whole like desert to theme that Big Thunder Mountain Railroad has. And I mean, what's deserty? Radiator Springs, Radiator Springs Racers from Cars Land. It just makes sense. Now, this is not like this rumor right here is just speculating that they might make Radiator Springs Racers. It is not by any means saying they're going to make a full on Cars Land in Walt Disney World. They're definitely not because it wouldn't make sense to build the exact same thing there because Cars Land is huge and it gives people more of a reason to go the California, so I don't think they would do that, and they don't even have the room anyways. I mean, look, there's not that much room there. I mean, Radiator Springs Racers is a huge attraction. It'll take up every bit of that space, so they definitely don't have room for an entire car's land, but then over there, it says villains. They, oh, it's rumored. They did say they want to make a villain's land, 
but it's the like the rumor is where it's going to be who really knows but it makes sense that it would be there right behind where like liberty square is you know like the muppets themed kind of area is over there i haven't been there in so long i really forget to be honest <laughs> but another rumor this isn't really cards related but they might take out um the rivers of america and tom sawyer's island a lot of people are upset about that and a lot of people are upset about this too uh, I think it's a good idea, but that's just because I'm a Cars fan, so I don't know. Maybe if I was an avid park goer, maybe I'd be upset because it is just the same ride that's already in California. So is it really that exciting? Well, it is to me because I, well, it's cheaper to go to Florida, and I would go there before I go to California next time I go to a Disney park. So I'd love for them to put it there because I'd love to experience Radiator Springs Racers, even if it's not the full-on Cars Land. I think it'd still be cool. But anyways, back to the article. It says, as a remedy to this problem, Mickey Views has previously reported that Disney is developing a desert-themed land for the Magic Kingdom. At the D23 Expo in 2022, Parks Chairman Josh Demaro teased this land. The area, referred to as Beyond Big Thunder, also incorporating a villains section, would feature Encanto and Coco attractions. Yeah, I remember that when they revealed that, and I thought, huh, I guess, but... What, wait until you read this next part. It says, however, at the next D23 Parks panel the following year, fans discover that Encanto and Coco plans had moved to Disney's Animal Kingdom as part of the Tropical Americas project. So yeah, there's the concept that they showed of how Encanto and Coco and Indiana Jones too, I don't know whether they're leaving that part out, is all going to replace pretty much like where Dino Land is right now in Disney's Animal Kingdom, which I don't think is a good idea, because none of those really are, like, animal-related. I mean, I guess somewhat, but not really. Not enough to be an Animal Kingdom, at least in my opinion, but whatever. Then it says, no update was provided on Beyond Big Thunder Mountain at the D23, or the 2023 D23 event. According to sources, this is because the plan for the other desert-themed attractions to complement Big Thunder Mountain had yet to be figured out. And then here is just some more uh, concept. It's actually, this isn't concept art. This is just um, concept from Mickey View. So this isn't from Disney officially. The other one was, though, where it showed uh, the Animal Kingdom stuff. But that is where possibly Radiator Springs Racers could go, right here where you see McQueen. And then, well, we'll get to this in a second. They want to put a Woody attraction too, but that's just a rumor, which would make sense because Woody is Western-themed. Radiator Springs is kind of westerny and then big thunder mountain railroad is as well they're all deserty themes so maybe instead of calling it frontier land you just call it because that wouldn't make sense to call it frontier land still radiator springs isn't the frontier it's not the old west but it is deserty so i think it's a good idea to be honest <laughs> it makes sense to me a lot of ip but i mean it's not why we go to disney world to be immersed anyways into movies you know, see characters and stuff. Like, isn't that the point? I don't know. People complain about that a lot. Like, they want more original stuff, but isn't that why you go to Disney World? <laughs> you know? I don't get it. Anyways, this is a cool image. I didn't even see that before. Wow. <laughs> it says, well, rumor is the plans are no longer so up in the air. Today, Mickey Views is breaking the rumor that a modified version of Radiator Springs Racers from Cars Land at Disney California Adventure is under consideration to be constructed behind the Big Thunder Mountain Railroad inside the Magic Kingdom at Walt Disney World. Wow, look at that, right behind Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. This is all just edited with Photoshop, but that looks pretty cool. That's potentially how the Magic Kingdom could end up looking, so that's pretty cool from a Google Maps image. And then it says the exact location and boundaries of the surrounding lands as part of this beyond Big Thunder Park are not known at this time. Disney has not confirmed any of this yet, although we suspect details on Beyond Big Thunder Mountain are at maximum only a few months away. Wow. <laughs> more details and more huge rumors can be found in our brand new Rumor Roundup, which we highly recommend you check out. And I already watched this video. It just sums up everything I just said. What just happened? I went too far down, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, that's a good video from Mickey View. So check that out if you're interested more on the topic because he gives his own thoughts and speculation on the whole subject but i just think this is so cool that image right here just looks so amazing i wish i could go to walt disney world and see a bit of cars land i just think that'd be so cool i know they don't have the room to make an entire cars land 
but still just doing radiator springs racers is enough for me let me know what you guys think though in the comments down below of this whole topic would you like to see cars a little bit of cars land at least come to walt disney world in orlando florida i think that's just sounds amazing radiator springs racers i'd love to have it just a little bit closer to me over here in canada so that next time i do go to walt disney world maybe i could go on radiator springs racers and see mcqueen and mater and all the other radiator springs townies i just think that'd be so cool but anyways be sure to let me know what you think of this whole topic down in the comments down below thank you guys so much for watching and with that i'll see you guys next time right here on the cars garage <laughs>